Hey, what's up? What's happening? What's going on? Back here, uh, The Wolf Among Us, uh, Episode 2, Smoke and Mirrors. I want to make sure I'm on the right, right save file, because I used two different save files. Because I did one thing and one other, and this is my main one. So that's the one I want to use. Let's see. I don't know how long that takes to load. But, uh, you know, I, I hope I can stay on point uh, as far as trying to carry a topic goes. I hope there's a more variety of characters in here, but I don't think there is. And that's really kind of, kind of shitty. Um, you know, I recently played episode one, you know, I don't know, two weeks ago. Something like that. Something like that. But, uh. I finished that, that finished going up and so I'm gonna try to have this video up within a day or two today is Tuesday which it released on PlayStation Network so I'm gonna try to have it up by Wednesday night you know considering the time it's gonna take to edit the video render the video and you know make up a decent uh, thumbnail to use but I want to shut the fuck up I want to get into it let's not take too much more time uh, hopefully it's exciting. Uh, I, I think I forgot to complain about some shit I seen out of place in the first one. And I want to give it at least, like, usually the videos are like 15 minutes long after I edit them and put them up. So, I'm going to try to give it 15 minutes, but then again, I'm going to... Oh. Do something, Big B, before he completely tears up the place. What's up? I'm supposed to shut the fuck up right now. Whoa, 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 hey, hey! You got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid c- <laughs> You're not as bad as everyone says you are. Please, Big B. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. Look, whatever it is, it's between you and Beast. I'm staying out of it. It's not what you might be thinking. What was I supposed to be thinking? Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Come with me. Oh, no. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow! You asked me a question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. Oh, no, I'm D. He's dumb. Good job with having eyes in the back of your head. You're gonna tell me right now. What... Dad! It's not even showing spoilers. Looking for the woodsman. Well, he's not here. Holly, you're out of paper towels and the... they're gonna string me up, baby. You said it looks fucking bad. It looks really bad, but I didn't do it. Am I All supposed right? to believe him? I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl name. Fuck, man! This fucking laptop. Come sniffing around this part. They're showing that out of order, though. Why? Oh, they did show one spoiler. Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. We'll see. Okay. We good yet? You done showing a recap of the last episode? We don't really need that. Just throw us right into the shit. Come on. So anyway, uh, you know, I had fun in the first episode. It was it was okay. I see room where there could have been improvements, but I doubt they improved it anymore here. I should go to their forums though. Like, come on. Then again, I probably have the unpopular opinions anyway. Mr. Wolf. Mm. 
What's up? You're making this more difficult than it has to be. If you just cooperate and answer the questions, you can go home. Maybe get some sleep. How are you feeling? I don't have. I want to. know it's been a long night for you. You look like you could use some rest. I'm feeling pretty fucking pissed off right now. If I'm honest, I'd like to smash everything in this room. Is that a threat? Depends on how much you like the furniture. I didn't think that was funny. In case you were waiting for me to laugh. It wasn't supposed to be funny. Look. You said I wanted to smoke. what you must be going through. Really, I do. But I could use your cooperation. Well, I'd appreciate if you'd fuck off. Big B, I've been interviewing people all night. And it's probably not the first time you've heard it today. Maybe you should take a hint. You're a detective, right? Well, you stonewalling me like this isn't helping either of us, so why don't you cut the shit and... Trying to help you, Bigby. What is it with you cops? Always trying to empathize with people. I know this must be hard for you. Do you? Do you fucking know? Have you had a friend killed and their head left at your fucking doorstep? No, didn't think so. Your nose is bleeding. Uh oh. You missed a spot. Yeah, you just smeared it across your face. You got a tissue or something? Detective Brannigan? I'm Detective Brannigan. Uh, yeah, I know. I just said that. Is there something? Oh shit. Something's all fucked up now. Please. I'm sorry. Just make it stop, please. That can't be good. You should be thanking me. It's just a memory wipe spell. Very expensive, but it works. The whole station will forget the last 24 hours and everything they saw at the woodlands. Well, hurry up. Might want to take that uh, camera with you, too. They won't be needing it. No? You're gonna take the picture and not the camera? Good job. Memory wipe spell. And some, uh, men in black type shit. You know, memory wipes and shit. I still haven't seen a fucking men in black 3. I don't think I have. I saw the first two in theaters, though. Nice leg there. How we doing? <clears throat> I don't want to talk to this guy. Whatever. This doesn't change anything. Fine. We, um... We found Tweedledee chained up to a post. That was your doing, correct? Yeah. Well, I don't know why you detained him. Dee was at the trip trap when Snow was left in the woodlands, so he couldn't possibly be involved in this mayhem. 
Bluebeard's currently interrogating him. And he hasn't said anything useful. He's working for somebody. And whoever it is wants him snooping around every crime scene I've looked at. That doesn't necessarily mean they're involved in the murders. They might know who is, though. It's a lead worth looking into. I know what you're thinking, Bigby. It's been one full night and a slice of morning, and I already miss her, too. Wasn't that her head you had in that box, though? You know, I never get more homesick than when one of us dies. And now, for it to be snow, I've never been good with these sorts of things. I just can't believe this is really happening. Dwelling on this shit isn't helping. Well, I apologize if my attempt at handling this has disturbed you, Bigby. But I thought we had some common ground. Let's get something straight here, all right? We had exactly nothing in common. Everything that connects us is dead, gone. We can kill him too now, right? I don't know why I'm asking you, but did she give any indication as to what she was thinking? When you saw her last, I mean. I don't know why, but I'd like to know that she was, I guess, fine, I suppose. 